It's time for Eric Plays Multiplayer Civ 6. Hey guys, how's it going? Just a little afternoon tea and uh, some cinnamon bread I made. Which I just spilled on my bread. Alright, let's see here. Let's move this guy this way. Oh, nice. Got some floodplains here. Okay, got some. Let's go here. All right, we'll save that game. Grab the next one. Still taking a bit longer to load than I wish. So this is not the game that's just uh, Dan and I. Oh, looks like uh, we've lost our desktop audio. Let me fix that. Brown people. There we go. And many people of the world look to you as a leader. But you are more than a mere man. And the weight of the world will never cause you to waver. Generally speaking, Encourage I like these the headphones. Of Suma the uh, GX Gaming. The fertile lands along rivers. And um, be sure to but they do have this tendency, if you just leave them plugged in, to I am kind fond of, of pigs. pretend they're not Dogs there anymore. Antioch. All right, let's go up there. Next turn. And grab the next game, which is the final Gathering Storm game, I think. This one, Davis Coupe. I'm really enjoying my single player Coupe game. Which, if you're watching on my channel in From order, you should have seen already. You have shown remarkable growth. Leave your bronze for iron and rule with horse and sword. The <coughs> sky above begin But if you're watching this out of order and somehow you ended up at this video, just go back to uh, March. And I've got, uh, I would say it's probably game 12. I'll have to look again later. It might be game 13, but game 12 or 13 is my Koopa game. I am fond of pigs. A lot of my games, people are discovering animal husbandry. Hmm. So it looks like I'm kind of at the edge of a continent here. <clears throat> Set this guy for over there. Submit that file. I don't watch Downton Abbey. I'm not as much of a period piece um, or period drama um, fan as my wife is. Although she doesn't watch that particular show either. <clears throat> 
but I did recently get a, you. Um, as part of a Humble Bundle, there was a Downton Abbey cookbook. I'm kind of looking forward to making some of the, uh, the tea accompaniments, you know, the lady fingers and other things that when people say tea and cakes, you know. This uh, cinnamon bread is about a week old. I made it last weekend. And uh, I have to say, it, it revives very well if you heat it up. I put it in the... Uh, I mean, I've had it, you know, in a airtight uh, Tupperware. Mmm. All right, an irrigation next turn, finally. Right. See if we can take this guy out. Not quite, but maybe. It's definitely a possibility. We'll just let him keep pressing, though. Oh, I guess I should have attacked the uh, spearman. That was a miscalculation on my part. Hmm. Alright, let's explore this little chunk here that we haven't done yet. happy to finally have irrigation so I can make use of some of those um, tiles around my cities. <clears throat> I will say, you know, while Civ 6 allows you to build um, more cities than Civ 5 did, right? So Civ 5 was a lot more against... Um, just sprawling empires than Civs 1 through 3 and I think to some extent 4 had been. <clears throat> 6 seems to be a lot more tolerant of large empires. Um, and with some of the bonuses they have for the districts kind of like clustering your empire together. Vessels large may venture. But the balance there then becomes, um, um, if your cities are too close together, there's not a lot of spaces for districts. And that's kind of hit me hard in some of my games. have built great cities of stone and seen early empires rise and fall. Must say I've really come around on cinnamon. Soon you will stand under the towering pinnacles of castles alongside your gallant knights. When I was younger the spiciness the aspect of cinnamon kind of turned me off to it a lot. Just as the young apprentice learns to carry a sword, but so shall you really like it to right understand now. your place in this world. It really adds such a great kick Queen to food. Sandu, the stars reveal you lead career to greatness. Build Seun to educate Whether you're talking about savior or sweet the secrets of the That's world one of the cool things about it, how versatile it is. Divide and rule a sound. Alright, so I can finally pick one of these. Let me see here. Uh no.
Hopefully I can come back to this. Yes. All right, so this is, oh, this is the one where I want to go against the Chinese. All right, so um, let's do one of these military ones. Let's say, yeah, this one looks pretty awesome. Yo. What's up with this bear? That's weird. <clears throat> Let's get uh, fair experience. Let's get plus two loyalty. Let's get plus two points here. Let's do some great riders. Yes. All right. All right. And so what I've got left are my three non um, expansion pack games, but I do need to take care of putting the kids to nap. So I'll. Um, have a part two to this, which will be those three games. So this has been Eric playing Civil 6 Multiplayer, and I'll see you next time. Bye.